Good morning. Today is a big day. I'm doing something I've always wanted to do, which is to donate my hair. I think I'm gonna cut off about 10, 11 inches. So we'll, uh, we'll see how it looks. I'm a little scared I'm gonna look like Lord Farquaad from Shrek, but uh, I'm hoping that's not the case. So wish me luck. Um, I've always wanted to donate my hair, especially after my mom passed away because when she had cancer, she did have to get a wig and it was always my goal to donate my hair after that. And I'm talking since like, well, I probably made that decision I wanted to donate my hair around middle school, but my hair has either not been long enough or it's had color in my hair or too many layers. So for the first time, pretty much ever, I'm able to donate hair. And I found an amazing organization called Children with Hair Loss. They don't make children pay or parents, children pay for the wigs. So all of the donation is 100% free for them. And you also only need eight inches to donate your hair. Most places are between like 10 and 12. So I'm excited. Let's do this. I don't know the last time I ever had somebody else start out the vlog, but I thought that was rather fitting to have Casey tell you she's cutting her hair today. We're gonna do a few things while she goes gets her hair done and we're gonna do all the fall things, but I think this video deserves a thumbs up for, for Casey. She's gonna look beautiful. She's gonna look different, that is for sure, but she's gonna look so good and she's always wanted to do this. She's sitting on my bed right now. I, I let her do her talking and I'm really excited for this video. Um, yeah, can't wait to see what she looks like. It's gonna be so good. It's gonna be so good. Um, it's about 9.30 here and uh, it's Sunday. Uh, Packers are playing today. Casey and I are going on an adventure during the Packer game. If you know that that is a big thing to leave my Packers behind and we're gonna have like a Casey day. She wanted to do this the whole time, but she did say I could watch the Packers while we're out and about. So that's good. That's good. Are you ready for your day? I am honestly so nervous. Um, I I don't know, I'm just, I'm really nervous because I do like my hair long, but it is time for a change. I know that it's like way too long for me because it doesn't really fit my face, but. And when I met her, it was probably about yay big, and then she cut it to like this. Yeah. So, it's gonna it's be good. Time. It it's is gonna time. be good. I love like a nice fresh chop too, because then your hair feels nice and healthy. And yeah. I'm it looks so I'm different. I'm so scared, I'm really nervous. But I feel like at the end of the day, even if I don't love the way it looks, I'm doing it for a good reason. Mm -hmm. So I think there's just I think it's going to look good. success in that on its own. So. We were like practicing. Remember in yesterday's vlog, I was like, show me short hair. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I don't think I did that in the vlog. I think you did. Did? No. You no, said, I think I hinted. You said you should. Maybe you should cut your hair. But a little did you all know, my appointment was this morning. So yeah. ah, I'm scared. Sorry. Messy bed, guys. All right, do you have any any last words? This is how long, it case, it's so beautiful and someone's gonna really enjoy it. Is there any way to find out who it goes to? Probably not. No, no that's like that's like an organ or something, but yeah, not, not for hair, but. Not for hair. <laughs> not for it's, hair. Not, it's not quite as important as an organ. <laughs> um, no, you just, you send it off. There's a few rules to it. It has to be clean, it has to be dry, and it has to be at least eight inches. And then you just send it off and then they do what they got to do. I'm not, I don't have a ton of hair, so it's not going to obviously make like a full wig, but my donation will help create a wig. So let's see it again. Let's see it turn on. Aw, it's going to be about like here, um, eight inches. Wait, okay. should we, well, let's get the ruler. Let's get the ruler. Let's see what it's going to look I like. Have like. Yeah. Boom. I, I prepared it in my little baggie. I have. The ruler inside. Yeah, the measuring. The measuring. And then I also brought little, um, you can't really see that, I brought little clear hair ties. Oh, Which I'm sure they're cool. gonna have, but I'm not donating through the hair salon, so I don't wanna be like a burden on them. So yeah. I'm trying to make it easy. But unfortunately, this is completely opposite. <laughs> okay, That's how much you're cutting off? Oh. Wow. <clears throat> Eight inches. So this is, I can probably get 10. I can probably get 10. Hold on. Actually, maybe not. 
Maybe about eight. Probably eight. It's up to you. Actually, you'll you'll decide. Eight. We'll see. I don't know. I can't really tell. It's hard to do just from here. You go on the back. Go on the back, and that'll be a lot easier. So you can kind of like see. There's eight. Oh, I think you could do ten actually. Nine, probably nine. But I might just have to do eight so that they can still style my hair. Uh huh. Um, we'll see. <gasps> I'm so nervous. We're gonna see it. If I look really bad. Stop. Then you're gonna look like this. This is what this is exactly what you're gonna look like. It looks so good. Cause it looks like you have short hair right now. Does it? Yes. I'm so scared. <laughs> you look so good. I actually like I do like having short hair. You're gonna look great. It's been a long time since my hair's been short. All right, you go do it. Maybe you should. <gasps> no. No, I know what you're gonna say. What am I gonna say? Take the camera with me. No, take your camera and just like maybe just document no, like two no. or three clips. I'm not, I'm not a YouTuber. Mm, I think she is a YouTuber though. No, I think that you should. I. She is. Yeah, a YouTuber. I told you you should come with me, but he was like, <laughs> I don't want to come to the salon and have a camera, and I totally get it. Yeah. It can be a little awkward, but well, just take my hair. hairstylist knows about you. Hmm. I know. She is wonderful. Can maybe. We? Just maybe like do a few clips. We'll see. It can be vertical too. <clears throat> You'd be like, here we go, guys. Here we go. No. Oh, that'd be so <laughs> no. cool. I'd be so proud of her if she did that. Well, I'm already proud this of her. It's already like, a big deal. That's a big so step. <laughs> Anyways. I don't know. All I'm right. never nervous to get my hair done. Like, I'm usually so excited, but this is a totally different experience, so. Well, she goes does that. We've got to open a few boxes that I've actually had here. Semi opened already. I just got to show you guys what's inside. I'm really excited to show you guys this. There she goes. Casey goes to a place she belongs. The salon. Take her home. Bye, everyone. Say goodbye to my hair. Bye. I'm nervous, I, but I got to go. I'm it's going to be great. So, I actually got these boxes while I was in California, and Joffrey's actually reached out to me a while back. This package has been delayed, um, just because of the fact that, actually I don't remember why it was delayed, but I was supposed to get this a while ago. I think they, they reached out to me on Instagram. By the way, none, none of this is paid. Obviously I love Joffrey's coffee. I get it in the park all the time, and wait till you see what they had sent me, or they have sent me. First of all, happy Halloween, Kyle. We hope you enjoy these villainous and spooky brews. Look at this. Look at this. Dragon Roast Brew, first of all. If you guys don't know, this is actually how I have my coffee now. I don't actually have it in K-Cups. I actually have it grinded, and Casey is gonna love this as well. So a big shout out to uh, Joffrey's Coffee for sending me not one, not two, but three different blends. Sea Witch Brew. Oh, this smells delicious, by the way, especially in the morning. Kind of a bad idea to do this because I'm gonna want coffee, and I know Casey already had some coffee made. And then we've also got Have a Bite Brew. I'll let you guys know if it's good. Follow my Instagram, because I might be doing something with that on Instagram. But yeah, super cool that they uh, reached out. Thanks, Joffrey's, for, for being a fan of me. I'm a fan of you guys. I love to get my Joffrey's, especially their chai tea lattes in the park, so that was kind of cool that they, they reached out. But not only did Joffrey's reach out, Coca-Cola actually reached out too. Keep in mind, none of this is paid, by the way. None of this is paid. We've got an even bigger box in this one. Wait to see this. This is super cool. Like, hello. Uh -huh. Boom. Bada bing. Bada boom. Look at how beautiful this is. Like, like what? And wait to see what is inside. Like, look at this display and this box. Absolutely crazy. All right, I actually got to show you guys this because this is so cool. We're so excited to partner with you to celebrate the collaboration between Coca-Cola and Disney for the 100th anniversary of the Walt Disney World Company. Wait, we got Park Hopper tickets in here? What? First of all, Coke bottles. Comment down below if you guys collect Coke because I feel like a lot of people collect Coke bottles throughout the world and it's probably a hefty, nice, really collection, meaning it probably is worth a lot if you collect all the bottles. 
Got Mickey Ears, the 100th. Coca-Cola Bear. I know my uncle actually used to collect. I think he still collects Coke stuff. This is neat. It's like an old style of Coke bottle, but it says Walt Disney World on it. We obviously got Coke Zero, and here's our goodies inside. All I can do is smell the coffee right now, and I really want to try some of that coffee, but uh, we're gonna have to wait. Lanyard, or two park hoppers. I think this is actually technically four because it's a two day park hopper. Super cool on that. I actually used the ones on Taylor that they Coke had sent last time, so thanks for that Coke. And then we've got or two pins here. Pretty neat, I've had this for a while just because I've been traveling, I haven't been able to show you guys, but pretty cool, some PR boxes here. But with all of that, let's, uh, I can't wait to see Casey when she comes back to see her new, her new haircut, and I'm excited for you guys to see it as well. Obviously, Casey had told you the backstory and why she always wanted to do this, and um, it's obviously a really special day for her. So if you guys could please leave a thumbs up or maybe even comment something down below, something super nice and supportive for Casey, it would be super amazing. And um, yeah, we're gonna have a nice date day, a nice adventure October day that we've always, or she's always wanted to do. And we're doing it today. All right guys, Casey is here. She's on the phone. She's coming on up. I'm so excited. I think she's nervous. Are you nervous? Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. I'm ready to see you. All right, go over here. Goodness, I'm so nervous. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's gonna be awesome. Are you in front of me? Mm-hmm. Okay, are you ready? I'm so nervous, oh my gosh. Three, two, one. Baby, you look so good. Yes, you do! It's just such a big adjustment. I'm kind of like... Oh I'm, my gosh. My Show. initial reaction there... You look so good! ...was I loved it, but then in the car, it's like you don't really know... You, you don't know what you really look like, so then I was just nervous. Babe, do you actually like it? Yeah. Ah! <laughs> you look so cute! Wait, really? Yes! I didn't know if you were going to like it or not. Feel my heart. You look so good. You Do guys I ready to see her? Yes, you look amazing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, flip this way for the light. Okay, you look so oh. good. Ta -da! You look so good. It is so short. Like, what? Give us a tour. Let's see. Let's see. You look so cute. I haven't even seen the back. Oh my gosh. You look so <laughs> good. Thank I'm so nervous. Like I, I'm just having a hard time. I think it look. I mean, I think it looks really, really cute. Um, yeah, my does. stylist is amazing, and she does such a great job every single time. It's just you know, it, you look so good. <gasps> look at you can curl it all the time too, if you want. Watch. Look at how crazy this is. <laughs> you look so cute. Look how small my ponytail is. <laughs> Come it's like on. A nub. This Wait. looks so good. Oh my gosh. Oh, there it is. Here it is. <laughs> you look wonderful. Check it out. It's really not that much because my hair is kind of thin. Wow. Look at that. You look so good. Look at that. That used to be my hair. <laughs> it used to be attached. I love it. You thought I what you said I wasn't going to. I don't know. This looks so good. Look at you. I'm serious. You look so good. You think so? Yes. Oh my gosh, I love it. Well, I'm glad you like it. Did you film anything? No, I didn't. No, are you too nervous? Sorry, I didn't. Here, let's, let's see what it looks like on camera together, both okay. of us. Hey guys, welcome back to your daily dose. You look so cute. It's so shy. <laughs> oh my gosh. I literally love it. Come on now. All right, camera off. Guys, leave your love down below. Casey looks amazing. Doesn't she? I love it. But what do you think? This is this is a you thing. I I do love it. I'm just, I'm having a little bit of cutter's remorse. It looks so good. It really does. 
You said <laughs> she goes in the car. If you touch my ear, it's the end of the hair. Like no, what? I said, you got literally. I said there's not that much hair. Left. What do you mean? You literally got like five inches there. She's like, it's up to my ear. It's dramatic. <laughs> no, I didn't say it was up to my ear. It looks okay. so good. Now we get to have a nice, cute fall date. A nice little thing that you've always wanted to do. <laughs> it looks so good. Good job. I'm gonna leave the link actually down below if you guys wanna do the same thing. Oh, for um, the place? Yeah, I looked yeah. it up, yeah, I got it. You did? Yeah. Yeah. Yay, we have to do that soon because I, I don't know if there's like a time frame after you get your hair cut that you have to send it in. Mm -hmm. But I just wanna I just wanna get it. I just wanna get it there. We can do the same time I send my iPhone in because I haven't sent my iPhone in yet. <laughs> hey, we just thought it was done. Look at it in a pony. That is so cute. Yeah, let's actually put it in the pony. Oh, oh. my ponytail feels so much thicker. Gosh, I love it. <laughs> it looks it's so, so good. Cute. Down here. Wow, you're a star today, Casey. It looks. I love this. Oh, I love I this could, too. Like, claw clip it, you know, like a cute little. Yeah, claw. claw clip. Yeah, of course. I'm gonna. I need to experiment. Also, I don't know how. To, I don't know how to wave my hair like that. So we gotta do some learning. <laughs> <laughs> we have to have a a new first first date because this is a new Casey. Southern Hill Farm. A couple of guys might remember this from last year. We tried going to this event last year, but you had to make reservations. So we learned for this year, and Casey's wanting to do this forever. Yes. So we're well, having I, a Casey I've day. I've done this before. I did it, I think it was in 2019, and then 2020 they did a drive through one, which was super cool. So you could still get all the yummy treats and what is Southern Hill Farm? A lot of people might be wondering. Yeah. Southern Hill Farm is, it's in, is this Claremont? Oh. Uh, ish. It's ish, kind of in the Hamlin area. Nowhere. It's a really, really beautiful farm. And during like October time, I think it's only in October, they do a fall festival. So you can do, pump, you can pick pumpkins. Pumpkins. You can go to their sunflower fields and you can actually cut your own sunflowers, which is super cool. And then um, in like springtime, you can pick your own strawberries and onions. They also do blueberries. I think you can also have events here. And they just do like cute little fun things. It's family owned, but this is for sure the best time to come. This is when they do the most at Southern Hill. It's our touch of the Midwest here. It's kind of chilly out here today too. It's, it's, it's lower 80s. <laughs> it's our <laughs> fall say, weather. I wanna say it's chilly, but at least it's not scorching hot. This is the only pumpkin patch in the area. And other than that, you can get pumpkins at Publix and that's boring, let's do that. Nobody. Like a lot of churches will do pumpkin patches, but this one is the most like fall esque kind of place. Oh, here's the front. Cool. Yeah. We're here already. Let's go in. Get a pair of wristbands. Well, are we gonna get? Um, oh, you gotta take the thing off. Yeah. Do you want sunflowers? Maybe. We gotta get you a new Instagram picture though. That's for sure. Oh, from with my new hair. Yeah, of course. Watch out for my I hair. I know. Though. I'm always so nervous to do this. Bingo. It's okay. That was pretty good. Look. Wait, there's actually a lot of people here. You see that? They're all walking out though. Oh wait, Chips? they have tractor rides? <gasps> peaches coming in April. Oh cool. So we there's don't like get the our peaches down in Georgia. We get strawberries coming in December. Beer garden. Beer garden. All right, we gotta get a pumpkin. They did, this. Okay, so they did have the petting zoo in the kids zone and then the food trucks the last time I was here. Oh, Pretty sure you do tractor rides. We should do that. Donuts. So we gotta go to zone two as well. Oh, it's right up here to the left. They have a corn Because we're right here, we're right here. So pumpkins are literally right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're usually, I think they're on the left. We gotta oh, do that. We should do that too. We gotta do all of them. Ooh, oh my gosh, it's like here. Wisconsin. I'm good. Wait, wait, so you pick your own blueberries? Yeah. Like when it comes? Yeah. Here's kind of what it looks like. It's like a long strip. It's like a farm. I love this sign. Be nice or leave. Oh, so we, it's not like a pumpkin patch because you actually have to go in like the building and buy it. I thought we were gonna be like picking our own oh, no. pumpkins. At least we're on a farm, though. I guess not I Publix. should have specified. Cause, like, I'm growing up in South Florida. Like, you don't really pick your own pumpkins. Ah, <laughs> uh, darn it. Like, this is more than just pumpkins, though. It's so cool. It's different. Different. Aww. The Packers are playing, and I just saw someone leaving just in time for the game. The game is actually starting right now. And Casey did say I can watch a little bit. I 
did. Well, so we're gonna watch some while we're here. You can watch as much as you want, but that was the trade-off because when we went to go buy tickets, the only time available was four. And he's like, I'll go with you if I can watch the Packers. Deal. I'll Deal. be happy. Just Wait, leave this, me here, I'll be happy. Is this the pumpkin farm? Yeah. <laughs> this is the pumpkin farm? Here's the pumpkin farm. We're gonna pick some out to uh, to carve on a later date in like two days, but I literally thought it was gonna be like Wisconsin, no. but this is fine, this is fine. No, this is like, this is more than just this. There's still enough. Oh, that one looks beautiful. Wait, Casey, let's get a picture right over here. This is cool. Let's get like a selfie. So definitely already a different experience from a pumpkin farm than I thought it was, but it's okay. But we're gonna have some fun. I probably should have warned you. <laughs> and we're sweating. Not supposed to be sweating while we're looking for pumpkins. Yeah, I'm not sweating, but... It's okay. <laughs> Alright, let's go inside here. Southern Hill Market. It's real cute. You can get so much things here, like peach jam, yeah. apple butter. What? Pecan apple butter? Apple and salsa? All this. that they grow from here. Peach habanero salsa. Yum. Hi. These are cute, right? Yeah, those are cute. I mean, this is coming up. Thanksgiving. I like these. These are cute. Oh, yeah. Oh, I spy cruise hats. You get those cruise hats right there, Casey. Sort of like a state fair in a way. They have rides over there as well. Yeah. Not sure why we need fires here in Florida, but we got fires. It's for the aesthetic. Might not feel like fall, but they gotta set the scene like it is. There's actually so much to do here. They have rides over there. We're gonna go pick our own sunflowers real quick. Can we come back in like February, Marchish when the uh, strawberries? Strawberries are here. Strawberries and blueberries, of course. All of these are the strawberry fields right here. You gotta walk in sand. I didn't think this one grew. Wait, should we do the corn maze first? Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> we keep just stumbling upon everything. And we're like, let's do this. Oh wait, I see that let's corn do maze. That Casey, how tall were we this fall? Let's see if I grew at all. Looks like it's 5'5". Five five. Sounds about right. Or 5'6". I think it was 5'4 last year. Wow, you grew. I did grow. Alright, let's see the corn <laughs> maze. Mater even decided to stop on by. You know Mater from yeah. Cars? Yeah. Now this feels like Wisconsin. I don't remember them having a corn maze. Here we go! <laughs> I feel like... Like it, the clown is gonna jump out somewhere. Trying to imagine it being cold out right now. It's a little toasty. Is it a dead end? I, I don't know. I think we just looped, actually. Just, yeah, yeah, we, we, we gotta, go that, way, we gotta okay. go that way, we gotta go that way, we gotta go that way. Follow the Casey we go. Follow the, follow the, follow the, follow the, follow the Casey we go. La da, da da. Get it, because we're scarecrow and we're following the Olympic road. Get it? A little bit odd too because the corn is growing in in sand. Wisconsin is dirt. Here it's like sand. The hair looks so good in the corn as well. <laughs> the hair looks good in the corn. Thank you. It's it the best so compliment good. I've ever gotten. I think we should go this way. This is actually a big corn maze. I thought it was gonna be like a little kid corn maze, but we've been walking for a while now. And I think we're officially lost. I'm gonna call it. We're officially lost. We did it! Woo! We didn't get lost and stay here forever, but... No, we actually did that kind of quickly. Yeah, we're pros. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're maze pros. Check this out, though. You never see this in Florida. All undeveloped land. And I believe that's actually the road where we drove on last year. We had to drive all around this. And there's the sunflowers. Um, what do you want to do? It's up to you. Um, I could go for a donut. Should All right, yeah, let's go, let's go in that line. I also want to do sunflowers, but if we plan on actually picking out sunflowers, then I kind of want to do that towards the end. Sunflowers and pumpkins. Yeah. Okay. I just don't want to have to carry them around. We should get some cider, too. Yeah. As a kid, absolutely. As an adult, uh, as a young adult. <laughs> I understand, yeah, I can't say I understand that. Uh-uh. No, 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 but this is fun for kids. Look at that over there. Oh, that's cool. I... It's all about the kids. This, this one scares me. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's, that's so cool. cool. Okay, as cool as this is, I, I can't do carny rides. 
I've just seen too many videos of too many bad things happening, but they have carny rides here. What the fuh? Casey is literally addicted to uh, pho. Oh, it's just too hot. <laughs> Correct. I want it so bad though, I can smell it, it smells amazing. Oh. Never had this as a kid, but my goodness, I want to go on that. How does that even work? That looks really cool. We decided to eat at Papa Diesel's barbecue. Let's hope it's good. It's like the one with the least lime, but it's still a lime. Let me tell you guys, this stuff smells and looks good. But will it be? We've got whole pork, French fries, and brisket. Not gonna lie, that looks a little bit fatty, but it, it looks look fatty. delicious in a way. Does that make sense? It's probably gonna be really flavorful. First bite, here we go. Food trucks usually never disappoint. That'll do for my tummy. This has so much flavor, and I honestly don't even need um, barbecue sauce. It just it has like a kind of like a peppered flavor on the outside. Very juicy, very tender. Let me just tell you guys, you know it's good when you get it all over your shirt. Down goes the shirt, the white shirt too. Casey goes, do you want any of this fat that I have left over? And I go, ha, I got plenty of that. I don't need that. Up next, we're doing the thing that was the reason why we came, and that is to get those apple cider donuts. There's we're, also blueberry lemonade that I want to get. We're going to get like a whole dozen of these because mm -hmm. supposedly they're really good. Oh, they are. You, We got to eat one on the spot, and then we got to save some for dessert this week. I, don't I got a whole dozen donuts. <laughs> I'm so excited. I have been waiting all year for these. You want to try it in the car? Yeah, try it in the car. Why? Okay, let's try it here. Okay, okay. We're actually gonna sit in the grass and do it. Let's try one of these bad boys. Also, this apple cider is amazing. It is? Oh yeah, try it. It's actually Maybe really good. Like, it doesn't, doesn't yeah, look it didn't that look good. the greatest. I also got blueberry lemonade. It looks so pretty. Me? Yeah. No. The sunset. Well that does too, but you know. I, I honestly you're looking at some nice things. So. Oh boy. You can have first bite. Should we share one together? No. <laughs> I want my own donut. Okay. Casey's been hyping these bad boys up. Really doughy. It's good though. Your reaction is kind of blah. Are they not good? They're good, I'm just full. Oh, your reaction's just blah, Casey. <laughs> they are extra doughy this time. Yeah. I still love them, but I feel like they were better the last time I had them. Mmm, no. I think the ones I love are their blueberry ones when you come for the blueberry picking. Mm. I think that's what it is, but these are still so good. One last thing to do, time to get a pumpkin a piece. Let's get it. There's actually a lot more things we should be doing. We should be going to the sunflower fields. We should. But. We could. Do you want to? It's up to you, this is your day. Oh, it's mine? Oh. You did say that, but. <laughs> they got a lot of small ones, a lot of cute ones. I'm like, Casey, you can't carve these. Look at this one. That's it's so nice. cute. I love these little ones. Oh my gosh, we can eat, you. Oh, we can bake pumpkin seeds. Oh my goodness. I think this one's perfect. This one right here? You like it? Yeah. I like this. Cool, this one's mine. Double thumbs up. It's a delicate process, you know, picking out a pumpkin. I feel like you picked out the best one. Did I? Kind of. I had my eye on it when I came in. You did, you did. I think there's one there's some over, there. over here that I want, but we have to wait a second. Yeah, people are taking pictures. Gotta get the gram, the Instagram photos. Wait, they're 29? Oh, those right there, forever pumpkins, $29. You can buy that. That's kind of cool. It's a cool decoration. Old propane tanks. She has found her pumpkin. I think it's gonna be this one right there in the middle screen. Yep. Yeah, grab it, grab it. Get it. <laughs> it's a big boy. <laughs> it's big. This is my baby pumpkin. What's its name? We have a name right here. Uh, right, let's purchase these bad boys. <laughs> <laughs> For the record, guys, I insisted on carrying hers. I'm an independent woman. <laughs> I can carry my own pumpkin. <laughs> we got a long way to walk. And touchdown. We're two pumpkins. We're gonna carve these, like I said, okay. at a later date, guys. It's so beautiful. Oh, there's someone like flying in the sky.
you want to do that next weekend? Actually, yeah. And back home we go. What a nice night. Well, we just got home watching the Packers. They're still losing. Casey has to stay by the front door because let's see, let's see those shoes. Let's no, see those. Oh no! Her feet are so dirty. Wear sneakers, dirty sneakers, old sneakers, whatever it is. Don't wear sandals. I made a mistake. It's okay. Should have known. We had I fun. Didn't think about it. We got our pumpkins here. There's one there. We're gonna carve them probably in two vlogs from now. Probably, probably gonna make like a nice dinner and carve pumpkins or something. We'll figure it out. But uh, thanks for joining and thanks for giving Casey, I'm sure, a lot of love down in the comments. Thank you all. You guys are the best. We had a fun day and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye.